sheep's head. Several okay. miles. Yeah, this is actually a pretty decent one. Hold on, let me get my nut. Pretty decent. Nice. Nice little fish, Chris. All right, guys, we have changed locations from yesterday and the day before and the day before and the day before. And last week. Yeah. <laughs> we have gone up to Harriet's Bluff on the Crooked River. And this is our first troot. And it could be a keeper. And it looks like a keeper. I don't know if y'all probably can't see it because I got it. There it goes. Nice and healthy. It is cold. We have on our coveralls. You got my Gatorade towel. Got their sponsored by Gatorade towel right there. They're sending us a check. The other direction. Oh. They're sending us a check today for an unsaid amount of money. Right it at 14. 14 and a. There you right go. Chris has already got two. Here we go. This is traditional. Uh, the traditional, not your boat move right. oh, of, you want the net? of catching the first two fish. They're a different color because of the coolness. Not bad. That's a good looking fish. That's two to O. But I mean O, I mean zero. Nil. Nil. Pure, pure soccer. Uh, so anyway, welcome to Nichols Retirement Empire. Let's do a little intro here. Got me, we're on Paul's boat today. We are at Crooked River. We are trying to fish Harriet's Bluff for the first time. Mm -hmm. We've already caught a couple of fish. Don't let the sunny, beautiful skies fool you. It's cold today in the 30s. But there's people out fishing. And we had to get out of the wind, so we asked the guy at the uh, North Star Bait and Tackle, isn't that it? Yes, sir. He told us we could go over, over here and get out of the wind, because it's a north wind. Mm -hmm. Just changed on us. Just yep. Because it's... Ago. Right, yeah. So, we, uh, it's probably going to come from the south now that we're here. Exactly. But anyway, right now we're just fishing float rigs and shrimp. We've had a few bites. Fishing by the birds. Yeah, we're looking for birds. Traditionally, when you say I'm looking for birds, you're talking about like seagulls and stuff. Uh, with us, it's buzzards. Yeah. We're looking for buzzards. And that's, that's worked for us so far. Paul's managed to, uh, he's got something. What do you got, Paul? Is it a troop? That's probably a troop. Crazy is I fish the opposite direction. Today. Yeah. We need a net. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, well, where's the net? Oh, where you at, bro? Just trying to figure where my fish is. Oh. I try to keep it closer to. Nice one. There you go. There you go. Finally, got a nice fish. Paul's on the board. I don't know if he's going to be a keeper or not, but. Yeah, he looks like one of them 13 and 13. But that's okay. If we were in Louisiana, we'd have we'd have, fish. we'd have three keepers already. I think they can keep about an eight-inch fish over there. Oh, get out! No, <laughs> it's like twelve. And Paul just found a hole. Lost one. I may need to throw over there. I found the hole, Christopher. I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna give you one more shot, Paul. Where? Before I come over there. If I get one more, you gonna come over there? But you know, we talked about this yesterday. We did? Yeah, that whenever somebody caught something that we should, we need to throw right, need to throw right there. in behind it. And then we, Why did that to you? I, well, I'm going to have to, I'm in this out monkey suit back here. I can't. <laughs> I knew I should have gone up there and threw. We even talked about it. I mean, that's, see, that's just my fault. If I don't catch fish, it's, that's on me. I showed you where they were. You did. You pointed. Go fish there, Chris. Go fish right there, Chris. Is this a swinger? Yeah, it's a swinger. That's not a that's not a netter. It's not a netter, but it's a fish. It's a beautiful fish. Okay, here we go. Chris is coming right up in here. That is a nice fish. Why are 
They all look good in the sun, don't they? Yeah. The sunshine shining on them. All right, Paul dismissed one. Yeah, I sure did. And Paul tricked me. Look, here's what happened. My, my stopper ran way up my line when I threw. That happens every once in a while to me. And here's why we know they're, they're uh, trout. Because your shrimp. Yeah, when they hit. there. And they don't tear your shrimp in half. You know it's probably a trout. We might have to scoot up a smidge. Oh, come on. Man up. This ain't getting to where I want to be nowadays. Look at that. See that? Boom! That's, right there. That's the honey hole. Right there. And I can't get there now because my boat has an anchor instead of a trolling motor. So if there's anybody out there that wants to give me a trolling motor. wants to buy me a trolling motor. To donate Gatorade. Gatorade, if you'd like to get me a trolling motor. Powerade, uh, pen, rods and reels. There you go. Yeah, when they school up in here, you can really get on them. Well, tonight probably really helped. I mean, last night, yeah. it's getting there. Was on with the, the jig or the swim bait? Uh, that, that on there? Oh, have we got that one? Yeah, shop? where's that at? Uh, Amelia Island. Amelia Island Beach Shop. Cool, put that on there. That's kind of the color of what I got on mine right now. You know, I could throw that. It's got Christmas colors. Yeah, it's a small one, but nice. Oh, yeah. Little one. Yeah. <laughs> GoPro stop recording. Probably another sheephead. There we go. Pulling. Yeah. Sure enough. Look at him. Nope. But that's twice as big as the one before, so next time. You get one twice as big as that. You're on them. There he goes. Well, baby one. The sheep head man. This time I got him. Didn't fool me. I wish there was some bigger ones. Yep. Tony would like some sheep said. This is a. Uh, this is a drum. Oh, that's a drum. Yeah. But they gotta be 14. Yeah. Okay. Here we go again. I think there's another sheephead. I like calling them smiling smiley fish. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Got him. Got him. Got another sheephead. Uh, sheephead. Or black drum. A shepherd. Shepherd. I hooked him in the eye. I that's not good. I mean, I get for him. Well, it's in the eye socket. It's oh, not okay. in the actual eye. No. Oh, huh? Another sheep head. That's, that's a good one. Getting better. Getting better, not big enough to keep it. That's got some girth to it. That might be a nettable fence, maybe. You think? There's a nut right by you if you want to get it from this. Man, I'm fishing, dude. Come on. Did you see? Did you see what I'm doing? That's something big. Something nice. Huh? What is it? Oh, it's a big sheeper. Is it a big sheeper? Yeah. A little big. Well, bigger than... Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. <laughs> nice job. That's a nice one. He's one I can fillet. That's it. Fat fish. Mm-hmm. Big. 
monster. That's big enough to eat. It's got a good smile. I've got, oh, a fish on. You got a fish on? Yeah. No, absolutely not. GoPro, stop recording. You gonna need the net? Might be another sheep head. They fight like a trout. Trying to get my. Oh. No, 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 you were doing the right thing. That's a weird net. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I was around you. I was. I can get him. Oh. Okay. Okay, Paul. I know I made you mad when I... I'm trying to figure out if I can fillet that. Seems like I have a sheep head there. It is. GoPro, oh, stop recording. Drum. Yeah, it's a drum. The drum. GoPro, stop recording. What we got? Another sheep head. No, a drum. Not a drum. Oh, it's a drum? Every time I say sheephead, it's a drum. Yeah, it's a nice fish. It's probably not a fish. Right in that fast water? Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, yeah. Nice one, Paul. Let me get the net. Might as well have because I didn't have a shrimp. Yes, sir. Okay, some success. Some success. <clears throat> nice one. Look at the rise at. So that hole. Show it to the camera. Yeah, there you go. Oh, nice one. Alright, just bring this fish in. <laughs> there he is. Good one, Paul. Yeah, thank you, sir. Yes, sir. Man, I have never seen anybody untie a line, catch a fish. <laughs> that was crazy. <sighs> nice one. We managed not to freeze to death. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. It's the tar Arctic. It's the Arctic tundra out here. Uh, but anyway, we got a good tip about how to get out of the wind, and we did. We got a good tip about a place to fish, and we caught some fish. And then we got even more good tips while we were out on the water. Somebody on the water actually told us what we need to do. And they were right. So, thanks out there, fellow fishermen. Nobody tried to cut us off and go between us and the bank. Everybody was courteous, polite. Great day on Nichols Retirement Empire.